Planet of the Fakes for Families and Pig Star HH News New Umbrella As trials begin in King J. Davila case, the baby boy's legacy lives on. Community efforts to prevent future tragedies and support survivors are out there. San Antonio trials are expected to begin this week for the three people accused of staging a kidnapping to cover up the death of baby King J. Davila. Baby King J's grandmother, Beatrice Sampeo, and Angie Torres, who is Christopher Davila's cousin, are set to go to trial Monday. Christopher Davila, the man who claimed to be the baby's father, is set to go to trial on Tuesday. The three are accused of staging the baby's kidnapping to cover up his death. Baby King J was reported missing in January. His remains were found a week later. Meanwhile, volunteers formed the group King's Angels in February in memory of Baby King J. The group says on its Facebook page, King's Angels recognizes that financial burden is one of the leading causes of child abuse in the home. They are collecting diapers and wipes, new socks, new underwear and baby formula to help local families. If you can donate to King's Closet, you can message them on their Facebook page to schedule a time to drop off at their office, which is located at 1445 Austin Highway. There is also a local group open to all families and friends of those who have died by violence. The group, called Parents of Murdered Children, meets Monday night at 7 p.m. at the Balcones Heights Justice Center courtroom located on 3300 Hillcrest. Sadly, there are many new eligible members, as the area has seen many high-profile murder cases, including the deaths of young women, who left children behind. The meetings are free. Like, comment, follow, share, subscribe. Then visit www.